Hello everybody, Tim here to talk about my best and worst uh, from the month of April. So I started doing this uh, last month, uh, March, just uh, talking about the movie I liked the best of the month and the movie I disliked the most in the month. Uh, just to give you some perspective, um, if you don't have time to check out all my reviews, this is a nice little spot to... Uh, see what you should really stay away from and what you should definitely check out. Um, April was pretty tame. Uh, we had a really big February and March, so uh, April was a little small. A couple big movies like Fate of the Furious, um, but a lot of stinkers in here as well. Um, not that Fate of the Furious is my favorite. I'm just saying it's a big action uh, blockbuster type movie in April, and that was like really the only big, big uh, movie. A couple of kids' movies uh, like uh, Born in China, the Disney Nature, and Smurfs, and then you got a couple dramas sprinkled in there, a couple comics comedies and it, it was an okay month um nothing like well one that i thought was like truly atrocious that i'm going to talk about and then but just a lot of okay movies like going in style um smurfs i thought was just okay you know there's just a lot of you know born in china i thought was just okay all these that are f just fine but the one I'm going to take for my best is going to be Gifted. Uh, Gifted is the Mark Webb directed movie with Chris Evans uh, about his niece who is like the math prodigy and he has to raise her and the grandmother comes back into the picture and uh, wants to take custody of her. And I thought it was a really cute, good little drama comedy movie. I thought it was just really well put together, nice good movie and you know like we don't get a lot of those any these days it's always got to be like either hardcore drama that's got to move me um or that it has to be like the best thing ever or it's disappointing or it's got to be the best action summer blockbuster or a big superhero movie and while i love the hard dramas like silence and i love the giant blockbusters like guardians of the galaxy and fate of the furious um it was just nice to get a little cute movie with some actors I like from a director I like with a good story and I just I really enjoyed Gifted so Gifted is my choice for the best of the month let's get to the worst of the month I just reviewed this pile of shit and that's The Circle and uh, when I think about worst movies of the year um, so far the two movies that come to mind are The Bye Bye Man and the Circle. I hated The Circle. And I'll throw a link up um, for my review of The Circle, but I bashed this thing. I thought it was terrible everywhere from the performances to the direction to the screenplay to everything. I just I thought it was everything. Everything was terrible. Um, I really hated that movie. I don't want to talk about it anymore. I'm done. Circle sucks stay away from it it had so much potential and it just fell 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 down so anyway guys uh that is my best and worst of this month april 2017 uh we've got a great month hopefully coming up here we got in may um i hope there's a lot of maybes that we don't know about king arthur i'm not a big guy Ritchie fan but i've heard good things about this one so i'm looking forward to it we've also got um pirates of the caribbean which i god you know i just don't know that last one was so bad but there's good things coming out about this one from uh, CinemaCon, so could be interesting but then there's also ones that just look just trashy like that snatched with uh amy schumer like the, yeah that just looks terrible so you know i hope it's gonna be a good month we'll see i guess so anyway guys uh if you like this video hit like hit subscribe i'll throw up my march best and worst up there uh right there click on that and you can watch that and until next time guys have a good one